purchase of Long Journey Home, also known as Two Dollar Bill, good old folk tune, can go anywhere from medium fast to blinding, like the Monroe Brothers did back in the 1930s on their record. Might want to look that up on YouTube sometime. I'm in the key of G. Lost all my money but a two dollar bill. Gonna start off with a pinch, five, three, one. Five, three, one. That's thumb, index, middle, all at the same time. Okay, that's just to kind of set up the rhythm. That's kind of a intro, really. So pinch, fourth string twice. Open. And then five, two, four, one. And I'm fretting the fourth string on the second fret. So fourth string twice, five, two, four, one. Now I'm going to do my open third string. And here's my two to five slide that we've seen fairly often. That's that measure. Three, four, three, one, five, three, one. With the slide in it. Now the slide is quick. It only takes up one eighth note. Three, four, three, one. So you got to keep your right hand moving through all that. Okay. And here's my Cripple Creek slide. I'm doing two to three this time on my third string. And it's just my, it's that same lick we did in Cripple Creek. Three, two, five, one. Slide from two to three on the third string. I'm going to do a double pull move here. This is my three to two pull off. I'm going to do it twice. Uh, and the uh, thumb index, thumb middle is my right hand. And my strings are three, two, three, one. And I'm pulling off from the third fret to the second fret. Okay. Now I'm basically going to repeat measure two again. Three, slide. Okay. Now this next uh, measure is going to be a three, I mean, uh, a um, four diverse roll is my right hand. Three, two, one, five, one, two, three, one. And I'm going to, we've seen this lick before too. I think we saw this in, uh, um, well, I forget, but anyway. <laughs> third fret on the uh, third string, open second string, second fret on the first string. And then five. Three, two, one, five. So really I'm putting two fingers on here. Uh, third fret, skipping the, leaving the second string open and fretting the first string. So third fret, first, uh, second fret. So three, two, one, five. One, two, three, one. Do my pull off there again. A little G lick here. Three. Three, two, one, three, four, one. That's a little different than some of the other ones we've seen. Usually it uh, goes to the second fret. But in this case, I'm setting up my C chord. So I'm going to do this. Um, it makes it into kind of a G seventh lick. So three, three, two, one, three, four, one. Fretting the third <clears throat> fret on the uh, fourth string. So open three, slide from two to three. Three, two, one, three, four. Here's my little C hammer on lick we've seen before. Hammer, pull off. Keeping my index finger down through this measure. Hammering on the fourth string. Four, two, three, one. Three, two, four. Hammer on the fourth string. And my index finger is up here on the first fret of the second string. Open three, open one. Now I'm moving this finger over to the third string to pull off. Keeping this finger on, going across to the fourth string. Okay, hammer, pull off. That's my C lick. And four, pinch, three, pinch. 
Now I'm basically repeating the first part of the song. Four, four. Slide, fourth string. Here's my little four diverse lick again. Pull off. Sorry, try that again. my ending sequence I'm going to uh, hammer on the second string going from two to three and I usually hit that with my thumb just to punch it in there real good that's this measure going hammer two to three on the second string and then five three one there's my pull off again my three to two pull off and open strings five three one Two, one, five, three, one, five, three, one. Here's my D lick. This is a little different because I don't use I don't go to a fifth string at all. It's three, one, four, three, one, three, four, one. I just kind of reverse it on itself. <clears throat> and I'm doing first finger. Uh, Third string, second fret. Forgive my voice here. I'm losing it as I go. And uh, using my third finger down here on the fourth string. So that's my part of the D chord there. And I'm not playing the second string, so I'm not fretting it. And my strings are three, one, four, three, one, three, four, one. So third finger here, first finger here. Fourth string, third string, fourth fret, second fret. So three, one, four, three, one, three, four, one. End it with my Scruggs G run. Three, pitch, fourth string, second fret, first fret, and I'm back up to the top of the page, leave the pinch out.
so. Okay? Hope you're having fun with this, and it's a good old folk tune.